Hey, what's going on people? So I got some Geekbench results for you guys on 2020 MacBook Pro 13 inch. We got the i5 processor and the i7 processor and let's see what the difference is. We got a i5 on the, on the left and an i7 on the right. Look at this. i7 45 65 multi-speed I mean multi-score and i5 4478 multi-score and I mean not that much of a difference but trust me I had few Macs <laughs> before and when it comes to i7 and i5 I always go with the i7 because they're just better they last longer you can do more things with them and um, I just recently bought one I'm waiting I don't know why I have to wait for a month uh, I bought the i7 MacBook Pro 2020 13 inch i7 32 gigs of RAM 1 gigabit uh, 1 terabit hard drive and uh, I actually applied student discount on it and I got it for like twenty four hundred and thirty dollars so that's amazing can't wait to get it to do a full review on it and you know the computer I'm using right now is a 2012 MacBook Pro 15 inch and I, like I said in the past videos it's a dinosaur and uh, I mean I upgraded to a solid-state drive and I'm running I have to run an older uh, older um, operating system on it high sierra but i upgraded some memory and it made it a little bit better they just i can't really do a whole lot in here i can produce awesome videos for you guys on this clunker so hopefully that's gonna you know help me out and get this ball going so i can make more videos and i'll be hitting a hundred and seventy thousand subscribers um literally very soon maybe in three days or so and if you like these videos share like subscribe and this is a Geekbench results between an i7 and a i5 10 generation processor on MacBook Pro 2013 thank you so much share like and subscribe to my channel